It's game night in the Orange and Houston tip off in their Sweet 16 matchup at 955. And that means fans who go out to a bar or restaurant to catch the game will have to leave at halftime because of the 11 p.m. curfew. The state said no to extending that curfew, but for Orange themed stories, News Channel 9's Andrew Donovan explains this Sweet 16 is still sweeter than ever. Hi, folks. During a pandemic, what may have been taken for granted has added meaning. For a business, it's every single customer. For lifelong Syracuse Orange fan Sean Voighton from Liverpool, it's a basketball team successful enough to deserve Sweet 16 t-shirts. It's nice to see something good happening and it's, it's, it's exciting and you know, bring some liveliness back into this city and, and, you know, get some excitement going. The excitement is what's saving the university sports shop after what the owner calls a horrible year. He calculates nearly a 60% loss in business. A lot of sleepless nights and, you know, you have to, you know, just dip into your savings account and cut back wherever you can. Cutbacks including his staff, now half of what it was, and his other store, the Great Northern Mall location, didn't survive leaving just Destiny USA, where new tournament apparel is now on sale. This is a shot, shot in the arm, if you will, I guess. You know, um, quite unexpected. Uh, business has picked up quite a bit. This shirt has the bracket of 16 teams. The owner hopes that he'll see Syracuse's name continue to move on to other rounds because he says as the team does better in the tournament, his business grows exponentially. And the Sweet 16 is a nice little jump. Final Four is a huge increase, so... Um, if we make the Final Four, they'll have a big impact on our business. We'll come in next weekend to get Final Four t-shirts. I like the optimism. And then a week after that, we'll get an Asher Championship t-shirt. Similar optimism is what's getting the team through the tournament, this store through the pandemic, and this community through the darkness. At Destiny USA, Andrew Donovan, News Channel 9. The owner expects today to be another busy day for his store at Destiny USA.